Welcome back to Fox 59 this morning. Can you believe it? As we take a look now inside Lucas Oil Stadium, in just three days, the Colts will hit the field inside the stadium for their first preseason game against the Denver Broncos. Hayden Barnack, Senior Marketing Manager for the Colts, joins me now with more details on the on all the preseason activities they have planned. Literally can't believe that we're talking about this, but it's about time, right? Yes, it's football season. <laughs> it is. <laughs> what kind of fun awaits fans who are planning uh, to be at Touchdown Town this weekend? So preseason is a great opportunity for the families to get together, to see new talent on the field, but also enjoy some fun activities and game day traditions at Lucas Oil Stadium, starting with Touchdown Town, which opens right before the game. It's free and open to the public at 10 a.m., full of entertainment. Um, there's the Play 60 field and yeah. the 40-yard dash where kids can test their football skills and you'll get to see cheerleaders and beer specials and all of the great things to enjoy that sunny day. It makes a, a lot of fun for sure. Tell us about the special blue color changing cups and how can fans get a hold of one of those? Those are, I hear they're popular. Yes, yeah, so it is our family day. So we want the families to come out and enjoy the game. The first 20,000 fans through the gates will get to the blue mascot color changing cups. Did you hear that? 20,000, first 20,000 yes. fans. And then there's tons of activities for families, especially kids to enjoy with face painting on the concourse, sign making, they can pick up coloring books at guest services kiosks. And blue is actually striking the anvil as well this what? Sunday. Oh, yes. That's pretty cool. Let's talk about the cheerleaders because they always hype things up. They're going to have a unique performance at halftime. Yes, our cheerleaders are, will be our halftime performance with over 800 junior cheerleaders and their moms. So we're really excited to have them perform together on the field. It should be a really great visual. That's pretty different. Mm -hmm. So you get to see the junior cheerleaders with their moms. Now, I'm going to go ahead and put it out there, but how good are the moms compared to the junior cheerleaders? They have been practicing okay. all week long, so rehearsals have been good. Right. We have a wonderful set of our Colts cheerleaders leading the charge there. That's awesome to be able to uh, see them out there participating and cheering with their their little ones that's yes. cool there's also a family four pack available what should fans know about that and there's time to get that to get ready for the game yes if you don't have tickets yet to the game the family four pack is a wonderful option it's four tickets for a hundred dollars and you get two free uh, meals from Qdoba that's pretty awesome four tickets for a hundred bucks and there's still a few training camp practices left that's what we, we've been talking about before the segment started, that the fact that there are several left and there is a special person we might be able to see at one of them. Yes, football is just getting started. So we have three more training camp practices left, one tomorrow, and then a joint practices next week against the Arizona Cardinals. All right, and anything we should know about? Um, well, we're excited. We have preseason next week against the Cardinals as well, so we're ready to be back in action for football this year. All right, Hayden Barnack with the Colts joining us this morning. Let's get ready for this week, and I'm pretty excited, and I know you are too, all of you guys over at the Colts Complex. For more information on the preseason game and Colts training camp that's still going on, go to our website, fox59.com slash links, and you'll be able to get more details there. Again, that four pack for 100 bucks, you don't want to miss that. Mm -hmm. Hayden, thank you so much. We appreciate you being here.